Hey boys, Miss Emily again here, and I'm coming to you for our story time today. The book that we are reading today is called Peanut Butter Rhino by Vincent Andriata. Or Andriani, sorry, mispronounced the last name. So let's see what the Peanut Butter Rhino is about. Today is the day that I have lunch with my good friend Elephant. He closes his lunchbox. Snap. I'll just check my lunchbox to make sure I didn't forget anything. Let me see. A delicious peanut butter sandwich, an apple, some carrots, and a banana. Everything, everything's here. And then he squish. Looks like he sits on his peanut butter sandwich. Hey. Where's my peanut butter sandwich? My sandwich has got to be around here somewhere. Maybe it's under this rock. Not under the rock, silly rhino. It's on his bottom. Monkey, have you seen my peanut butter sandwich? No, I haven't, rhino, but I will help you look for it. It's not up here. Lion? Have you seen my peanut butter sandwich? No, I haven't, Rhino, but I will help you look for it. It's not up in this tree. It's not in this cave. No sandwich in this tree either. Sandwich is still on Rhino's bottom. Sorry, Rhino, there's just no peanut butter sandwich here. Just some old cheese. It's no use. I've lost it. I'll just have to go see Elephant without my most wonderful peanut butter sandwich. Excuse me, Rhino, but why is there a squished peanut butter sandwich on your bottom? Squished? Good thing I brought two peanut butter sandwiches. One for me and one for you. Hooray! Yippee! So he didn't even have to worry that it was squished because his friend the elephant had an extra. The end. All right, I hope you enjoyed our story today, The Peanut Butter Rhino. Be on the lookout for another book tomorrow. Still got to decide what it is. I have a selection to pick through, so I'll pick a good one. Don't worry. Remember, boys, I love you, I miss you, and I will talk to you soon.